Hey guys, Casey Mock here, KW Farm and Ranch and Mock Ranches. It's a special day today. I'm up in the hill country showing ranches to some good friends from New Braunfels. Um, it's a special day. You know, on this day, March 2nd, 1836, our great state of Texas declared its independence from Mexico. You know, it wasn't until December 29th of 1849 that Texas actually joined the Union became an official state with the United States. And then in 1850, Texas ceded some claims, portions of land um, in what is now parts of New Mexico uh, to the federal government in return for bonds to pay back some debt that Texas incurred during its decade as a republic. Um, but because Texas fought for and won its own independence from Mexico as a republic, the majority of our land still stay privately held by you and I, and uh, very little control of the federal government on Texas land. The fragmented state as we know today was once, uh, uh, was once made up of few very large ranches um, that were fought for and bartered for and traded for with the Spanish and Mexican governments and the Native American people that once occupied our lands. But because we came about it that way, Texas is the only state where our capital stands taller than that in Washington, D.C. Our flag can be flown at equal height as old glory on the flagpole. Um, be proud when you own a piece of Texas. I know I'm proud to work for you and proud to uh, work for so many landowners in this state. Uh, that's my thoughts today. Uh, go get them on this fine Texas Independence Day of 2017.